is the most comprehensive, colourful and ambitious children's book about Welsh history ever to be written. It's a hardback with 224 pages, all colour, and throughout those pages the historian Ellen Jones takes us through Wales' rich past from the Cromlechie to the Senedd. Although it's aimed at 9 to 13 year olds, it is of great interest to everyone living here in Wales. It emphasises that the remnants of Wales past are all around us today, every day, and the text is supported with over 300 pictures and maps. This is a book for every household in Wales, but one that can also prompt all sorts of activities in school. It takes us on a visual journey through over 5,000 years of history all around the whole of Wales. Yes, there are pieces of history in museums and in libraries, but they are also all around us in old pictures, place names, on maps and in the remains of old buildings on hillside or by the sea. Why is Glyndon so important to Welsh people? Who are the first people to live in Wales? Why is water such a burning issue? One of the features of this volume is that so many women are prominent in it at every stage. It also breaks new ground by addressing Wales as ethnic minorities and Wales as relationship with slavery. What is great about this volume is that it takes us on a journey through the various historical periods of Wales. But at the same time, it makes the reader realise that he is living in a historical period of his own. The Red Wall has been such a powerful and unique symbol for Wales over the past few years, and it was decided to unite the past and present of Wales on the cover, representing Wales, its history and its future. Among them are some of the Welsh heroes and heroines who are named in the book and who have played a major role in the history of Wales. Owen Dundour, William Morgan, Lloyd George, Betty Godwalder, Gwynhian Merchgraffir, Elizabeth Campbell, and the diverse Wales which it is today. And just like the crowds during the international football and rugby matches, there are flags with the names of local towns and teams. But in this red wall, the flags mark significant areas, movements and campaigns in Welsh history. All these people of Wales, past and present, are part of our history, all waving a different flag. The Princes of Gwynedd, the Red Flag of Merthyr, the People's Charter, Women's Suffrage, Black Lives Matter. So where's your place in the Red Wall? And which banner will you choose? The cover artist is Ellen Manon Cooper. She is a freelance illustrator based between her two homes in Cardiff and Upper Val in Cornwall. Her work is often inspired by nature, landscapes, folk tales and folk traditions, especially those from Wales and Cornwall. History Grounded Looking for the History of Wales by the historian Ellen Jones. Published by Glas Caragwalch, a hardback book on sale for £16.50. Available online and in your local bookshops.